Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today, as you can see, we're going to do a gland up Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer and see how we created that look. Make sure you stay tuned. As you can see, most of my face base is already done, so let's go through and show you what I used. Ardell's Brow Pomade and Dark Brown. My face base is Miron's Clown Paint and then I used Hard Candy's Glamouflage Foundation. Today we'll be using the Unleash Your Inner Artist Palette from James Charles and Morphe to do our eye work. We're hopping right in that crease with Benny, just to carve out what we're going to do that full cut crease today, patting it in so we have that color intensity, and then we're going to buff it out. And then we blend it a little bit, we're going in with Boutique, which is like a brownish red color, and just blending it in, as you can see here. Here I am just going with the completely clean fluffy brush and just blending that edge out so it's really blended and fanned out um, a little bit bigger just because I like the eyeshadow to really span out almost to my brows. Here we are just going in with a concealer brush and concealer, mine is Tarte's Shape Tape and we're just going to cut that crease. Um, so I just take my time and go right where I want to cut it and make sure it's real precise, real clean, make sure you got enough concealer on that brush and then you just go in. Now I'm going to go on with flashback. We're going to start right in that corner and I like to go along the exact line where I cut it just to set that first to make sure it doesn't move. And then I will go back in and fill in any of the other space that we've put concealer just to make sure everything is set really well. But I like to pat it on nice flat and firm and then I'll go in and really put a lot more of that eyeshadow on just to make sure we've saturated enough so it's not going to move. Got to make sure we add a little bit of shadow to our bottom lash line. Here I'm just fanning it out also gently and real lightly. I didn't put any extra shadow on my brush. I'm just taking what's there and fanning it out so it gives a little light feathered out appearance in both corners. Then just blend away like your little heart desires. Both eyes are done. Now to do the face. Going in with Pop Beauty's Contour 101, which is one of my favorite contour palettes lately, if you have not noticed. Um, it's got a highlight blush and contour in it, but I use the blush and contour just to contour up the face the way I like it. My silly behind forgot to show you, but I'm using Mayron's Paradise Paint, and this is the red. I got the Basics palette, so it gives you all the basic primary colors. We're just going in with a little bit of red to make the heart on the nose, and then we'll do a few hearts right um, by the eyes where we did that cut crease. Next we're going with Morphe and Bretman Rocks Babe in Paradise Highlight Palette. Just put a little bit of highlight right on top of those cheekbones. Here we are just using NYX Glitter Glue and some gems I got from the craft store. And we're randomly gluing these on as if we had the reindeer spots. So instead of creating white spots or concealing spots out, we're using jewels instead all over the face where I thought I would want them.
If you can tell by now, I'm using a couple different sizes just so my spots don't all look the same and they're not all chunky. Um, I do recommend doing that because not all the spots look exactly the same on any animal. Um, if you have different sizes, I wouldn't use different shapes though. For the lips, we're using Too Faced Melted Matte and Sugar Cookie and Cinnamon Bear. Here is our final reindeer look with our glammed up Rudolph the Red Nose reindeer. I hope you guys loved creating this look with me. It's pretty simple and to the point, um, but it's always fun to do something a little different, especially for the holidays. We are doing 12 days of Christmas, so we're going to be doing 12 different characters or 12 different spins on 12 different characters. So make sure you subscribe so you're not missing anything that we're doing here for the holidays. If you guys have any suggestions of anything you want to see, just make sure you leave them down below. And I hope to see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye!